Today we're going to look at the Gen 2 steel sheet holder and how to install it. The model is composed of five parts and requires 12 M3 by 8 screws and 12 M3 nuts. The easiest way to install the M3 nuts is to temporarily take one of the M3 screws and place it through a hole and pull the nut into place. After installing the M3 nuts, let's move on to assembling the back piece. Notice the tabs and notches in the back piece. This allows you to only place the connector in one direction. We're going to install all four of those. After all four are installed, just double check them, make sure they're all straight and everything, and we'll move on to attaching the sides. Both parts look very similar, but the right side has a logo on it, so keep that in mind. Next we'll install the rails. The mounting brackets on these should be facing backwards once installed. If you want the steel sheets to snap in place, you can add magnets to the back piece. And that's it, we're ready to install it. You can secure them in place either directly under a drawer or with the rear brackets using an upper rail lock. And that's it. Now find all those steel sheets you have lying around and put them in their new home.